didn't know there was an expiration date. I just... I just don't understand why. I don't understand why we have to put a label on it. Because... Because that's what people do. They, they fell in love and they decide to spend their life together. Just because that's how your parents did it doesn't mean that's how we have to. Then what? We just never get married? Not never. I've been a bridesmaid five times, Casey. Five times! When is it going to be my turn? It will, just not now. My friend keep asking when, it, when it's going to happen. To hell with your friends. Why does it matter what they think? Why should I do what your friends want? Cassie told me she thought you were a ghost entry the first time she saw you. Cassie? Screw Cassie! Screw everyone in their BS opinions and judgment! Why can't I just live my own damn life? Thank God I found you. I just fell Shh. off the... What? Shh. Hello? Shh. Why are we whispering? She scared away the wapi. The what? I know her. Maddie! Over here! Shut the hell up. Great, you just lost me my payday. No, we know each other. Who will recognize you? What are you talking about? Where am I? What's going on? What's going on is you just lost me my payday. You're going to help me get it back. So grab the card. What's in this? None of your business. This way. So how do you two know each other? Who? You and the Wape. First of all, her name is Maddie. Second of all, we're together. Oh, husband and wife. One of the most beautiful bonds in the world. No, we're not married. We're just together. Oh, painted lady. No, 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 no. It's not like that. I mean, we're just... Wait here. It's close. We camp here. It was. It's the love of my life. We'd camp outside and watch the stars, and she'd tell me all about the constellations. I didn't much care about it, but hell, I could listen to her talk about just about anything. For me, it was the moments with Maddie where we didn't talk, where we could just be together, you know? Now she won't shut up about getting married. In my day, it was the man who had to convince the woman to marry him. Yeah, well, times change. Marriage is different now. Now it's something people expect of you when you get a certain age. Love hasn't changed. What do you know about love? You're not even real. Make me what you want, but the reality is, is that there's someone out there that loved you and you let it slip away. I didn't let her slip away. Her friends and family pushed me away because they decided that we weren't good people if we didn't get married. So you didn't get married because other people expected you to? If you didn't want her to be yours, then why are you pulling my cart through this barren wasteland to find her? Get the cart. You're right. I want to marry you! Hey, I want to marry you! I figured it out. I, I want to marry her. If brains were leather, you wouldn't have enough to saddle a Junebug. No, you don't understand. I figured it out. I'm ready to go back. What do you mean back? It's like when the main character hits his head and goes on a spiritual journey to figure out what he has to do. You know, like uh, that episode of Sherlock Holmes. What the hell are you talking about? I hit my head. I went on a spiritual journey. I had my epiphany. And now I'm ready to go back and do the right thing. I got some bad medicine for you, son. You can't go back. 
What? You're dead. What do you mean I'm dead? I'm not dead. I can't be dead. I just figured my life out. What life? Is this a joke to you? Do you think this is funny? What the hell are we doing here? Please, enlighten me. What are these for? They're whopping. Hope. Sometimes when someone passes over, they leave loved ones behind. I capture that hope. How can you do that? When you've been here for hundreds of years, you just give about anything for a little hope. <laughs>